Three students, aged from the 36 states, including the FCT, will be receiving scholarships from the Association of Nigerian Students in Europe. The president of Ansem Mohamed Saidu mentioned that the scholarships will be channeled through the Ministry of Education and Scholarship Board. He emphasized that benefiting students will be able to apply directly for the scholarship in the coming years as the association is working towards that. I would like to announce that ANSE, under my leadership, will begin by offering scholarship to the 36 state of Nigeria, including FCT, for students to study in Turkey. This scholarship will be channeled through various ministries of education and scholarship work. A few slots will also be offered to various stakeholders, and there will be more to come. We wish to inform all Nigerians wishing to study abroad that we will come up with a program where they can apply and get scholarship directly from work. The issue of those uh, who are studying medicine, medical, whatever, that they sell the, uh, that they are doing their lectures online, that the Nigerian medical, whatever, will not uh, you know, take their certificates if they give it. And uh, I think uh, on that, I've been trying to meet with uh, Abike Dabri, which is uh, uh, diaspora, and uh, to know what and what we need to do. Because, you know, most of the university in Ukraine also have application in all these, uh, 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 like Poland, the, most of the university in Ukraine also have application from schools in, in Poland. So, and I think uh, that is what I'm trying to do if the Nigerian uh, ambassador in Ukraine can meet the ambassador in Poland, so that those of our Nigerian students, those that are still in camp in Poland, can at least, uh, so far they have a uh, nation with schools in Poland, so they can. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.